In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to play Minecraft with a keyboard and mouse on a PlayStation 5. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. First, before I start talking about the process of setting up a keyboard and mouse on a PlayStation 5, I want to make it very clear that this process is extremely straightforward. So, as long as you have a way to connect the keyboard and mouse to your console, usually done by using one of the USB ports and connecting them through a USB cable, you will be able to use a keyboard and mouse on Minecraft on any device, any platform, including of course the PlayStation 5. So all that you have to do, if you haven't tried it before, is to use one of the USB ports. Immediately, you should see a cursor pop up when you are inside of the game, and by hovering your mouse around on the settings and selecting things, you should be able to use it to select stuff. The keyboard should also be working, you can try it out by either typing a message or going over inside of a world. Now, if it doesn't work, some of the things that you can try are to connect only one of the peripherals at a time. It might seem simple, but go ahead and disconnect both peripherals, the keyboard and the mouse. Try connecting only the mouse and shaking it around to see if a cursor pops up. If the cursor does appear, then you can go ahead and connect the keyboard afterwards. Or you can try the opposite, connect the keyboard first and then the mouse. A lot of users have reported that when they tried to connect only one of the peripherals, used it for a while, and then connected the other one, it worked out better than when they tried to connect both at once. So, with that out of the way, like I said previously, they should automatically be set up. You can visit the settings and see if you have a keyboard and mouse control scheme settings where you can change all of the options related to them. Even if you don't, they are going to be natively working and you simply have to be aware of how to control the game using them. With this out of the way, you should be able to join a world and play right away. Like I said previously, if you are unable to connect the keyboard and mouse, it could indicate a problem with the peripherals themselves, because Minecraft natively supports keyboard and mouse controls on any platform, including the PlayStation 5. So if you are able to try using a different USB cable to connect the peripherals to your console, you can try using a different set of peripherals altogether, so try getting a new keyboard and mouse if you have a backup one available and seeing if that works, which could indicate that the original keyboard and mouse combo that you were trying to use wasn't working properly. With all of these steps out of the way, you will be able to join any world and everything will be adjusted to be compatible with the keyboard and mouse. All of the keybinds will change and you should be able to play natively. So if you encounter any problems while trying to do this, it is usually attributed to the keyboard and mouse combo that you are using or it could indicate a bad connection to your console. So make sure that the USB ports that you are trying to use are active and working flawlessly or try connecting them wirelessly through Bluetooth. I hope I was able to help you on how to play Minecraft with a keyboard and mouse on the PlayStation 5. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.